Brigadier Michael Ondoga will attempt to extricate himself from the monk waters after scandal in the army exploded in the media two months ago. It revealed that UPDF commanders and their accomplice allegedly sold fuel and food rations meant for soldiers in the war ragged horn of Africa on the black market in Mogadishu. While appearing before the chairman of the General Court Marshal Brigadier Moses Sentongo, Ondoga was accused of committing the offences between October 2012 and August 2013 while in Somalia. Under Section 123 and Section 124 of the UPDF Act, any officer who fails to brief and whose personal interests endanger operational efficiency could suffer life imprisonment or death. Ondoga was jointly charged with Lieutenant Colonel Sam Kiria, a former contingent and military information office. Another officer independently charged was Captain Atugonza, a former contingent and logistic officer. However, he alongside his colleagues denied all the charges. Though the trial applied for bail, it was not granted because their application did not meet the prerequisite standards of the court and will reappear before court on November 5th while their bail application will be reconsidered. During the court proceedings, it was alleged that on 27th March 2013, Ondoga and Kiria are aware of their duty to brief the commanding officer of the Ugandan Contingent Special Forces Command in Somalia. The two gave false information about the enemy position at Jamal and Sharambot, putting the life of troops in danger. The two are further accused of failure to execute duties after they were informed that civilian premises in the neighborhood of Al Jazeera training center had been attacked by the enemy. Atugonza was charged for five counts which include failure to execute duty, offenses related to documents, failure to ensure the supply of food and water to the contingent. According to the prosecution, failure to deliver food and water affected the health and combat morale of the troops. Maurice Achol, NTV.